travel vlog, I'll be showing you why Dubai is becoming one of the most visited cities in the world. Travel with me through some of Dubai's biggest attractions and hidden secrets, through the deserts and the markets and the most luxurious hotel in the world. I'm showing you the best of Dubai. So right now, I'm right outside the Burj Khalifa, the world's tallest tower, standing at 828 meters high. The Burj Khalifa currently holds four world records, including the highest occupied floor, the highest outdoor observation desk, and the tallest service elevator. There's also a tour called At the Top, which you can experience the view and the height of the tower. Atlantis the Palm is one of the most popular hotels in Dubai, known best for its Lost City of Atlantis theme throughout the hotel. Inside is incredible ceiling paintings and structures, which all link into their underwater theme. The hotel has two underwater suites, with floor-to-ceiling windows looking into the Ambassador Lagoon. Burj Al Arab is one of the most photographed structures in the world and also the world's most luxurious hotel. If you click on the box in the bottom right hand corner, you'll be able to see my room tour of the suite which I stayed in at the Burj Al Arab. The Burj Al Arab was designed to resemble a billowing sail of a ship and standing at 321 metres high, it makes an impressive addition to the Dubai skyline. To make things even more inspiring, the building is illuminated at night by a choreographed light show representing water and fire and is a great photo opportunity. At the moment, I'm just near the Souks, that's all the markets, and compared to the area that I'm staying in, this is, I love it. It just shows like, the culture, the, the people here, and there's so much to do. I mean, we just ate four people and it only cost us uh, like 15 pounds. And just to give you a quick look, this is what it's like. So you can see how lively it is at night. And there's so much to do around here. So if you're looking to do something in Dubai and you want to hang around the locals and stuff, this is definitely the place to be. Once you land in Diera, all you have to do is follow your nose and take in the breathtaking selection of spices, such as ginger, chili and cardamom. Even if you're not looking for anything in particular, the gold took is worth a visit. See all the glittering array of merchandise. There are over 100 jewellery shops in Dubai, and with no taxes, low import duties and high turnovers, allows it to be one of the cheapest cities in the world to buy gold jewellery. You are now going to experience the Dubai Fountain Show. With over 6,000 lights and 50 colour projectors, they create a breathtaking show synchronised with classical Arabic and world music. an opportunity to navigate the 30 acre Burj Lake. With reasonable prices it is definitely something that you should visit whilst in Dubai. so easy. I mean, they have um, trains and the taxis are so cheap as well. So for example, if you're going on a 20 minute taxi drive, it costs you about £3, £4 if that. So for example, it's a little screen that pops up right there and it'll tell you how much it costs. In terms of excursions, there are so many fun activities to do whilst in Dubai. From helicopter rides to desert safaris. I'm going to give you all a little tour of the Dubai Mall. I'm just looking at the boutiques, they're beautiful. And I'm currently in the village and oh my god, I have just seen the most incredible water feature. Oh my gosh, look at this. Oh my god, why do we have nothing like this in England? Dubai Mall is extremely easy to navigate around, with interactive boards located in the mall to help you find the shops that you need. In terms of eating, there are several different restaurants. There is also an outdoor mall with several activities outdoors, perfect for a family day out. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you'd like to see more travel vlogs, then please subscribe.